Welcome back to Varun's channel and this is Anu again uh, making something for the fasts that are going on for Navratras. I am making Sabudana today and we are making two different dishes. There is Sabudana Khichdi and Sabudana Gada. If I have a fast, I have to make Sabudana in some form or the other. So the Sabudana Khichdi that I am making today is something that I make every Ikadashi and it is a very very simple dish. I will show you how. The most important ingredient for sabudana is sabudana in itself and it has to be soaked perfectly. Let me show you how it is. Um, usually four to five hours of soaking is enough but uh, some people like to do it overnight in order to get a nice fluffy um, consistency. Yeah, But we don't take too much water when we are soaking it. Pani andaze se leti hu, but it should be about one to one and a half times. And the second most in important ingredient of uh, sabudana khichdi is ghee. We cannot make it without ghee. At least uh, I would never attempt it without using a nice amount of ghee over here. My pan is hot, so the ghee is melting. Or is garam ghee mein mein dalne wali hon. Zira. Just a little bit. There we go. Or hing. I like hing also in my sabudana khichdi, and this hing is really special. I get it all the way from Lucknow, but you can use whichever hing is available with you. Now the other thing that goes into this particular dish is curry pata. I wonder uh, if you have seen our previous video of uh, the fight between Varun and me. We were discussing a UP dish which he claimed to be Maharashtra and this one actually is a Maharashtra dish. Let's see what he says about that. <laughs> And I've put in my curry pata and my green chili and now I'm gonna toss in my potatoes. These are just big diced potatoes. I'm gonna toss it just gently in here. These alu I have already boiled. So that it will be done. But if you want to use kachya use karna chate hai, then I would suggest you cut them slightly smaller so that they cook faster. Yeah. And here I'm going to put in my salt and a little bit of haldi. Just a little bit. Haldi is again optional. A lot of people like to make their sabudana white, then they don't add haldi. But I like mine this way. Okay, so you can see I've got a nice golden color. Okay, abhi to tayar hai and I'm gonna put in my sabudana in it. So fun fact for you, Varun doesn't like potatoes in the sabudana. For some reason, whenever I make it for uh, the fasting, I have to make one bowl for him with onions uh, or kandha. The reason being, I think, he likes poha so much that it reminds him of the time that when he is in uh, Maharashtra. So I'm, I'm making it with potatoes this time and I'm sure he's gonna ask me where is his bowl full. Now here I have some peanuts. I like to put peanuts in mine. They can usko full nahi dalenge. It has to be beaten a little bit. 
थोड़ा सा क्रश करेंगे तो वो फ्लेवर अच्छा आएगा एंड यू नो द क्रंच फैक्टर विल बी देयर सो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉस दिस इनटू माय सब दा आई एम गोइंग टू लीव इट कवर फॉर अनदर 5 मिनट्स It's a beautiful color, and the sabudana is almost ready. I don't toss it too much because I don't want to disturb the potatoes. Already boiled away, me. If we toss it too much, then they will be soggy, and we will make soggy potatoes. Okay, so another few minutes, and that's going to be ready. In the meantime, I'm going to start. On the sabudana vada. Now, my daughter Amara, our daughter Amara, she is allergic to peanuts, so I end up making this for her without peanuts. But I'm sure a lot of you would like peanuts in yours, so I'm gonna add some just for today. Um, there is crushed potatoes over here, crushed or grated, but definitely boiled. and then again the soaked sabudana now the ratio i use is 1 is to 1 so if i'm using 1 cup sabudana there should be 1 cup of boiled potatoes agar aapko aloo zyada pasand hai to 1/2 cup bhi dal sakte hain um and a lot of people actually use sweet potatoes with this the other day a friend of mine was saying add sweet potatoes instead of potatoes it will give a really nice flavor i tried it and it is sweet So I'm making it the traditional way with potatoes and not sweet potato. I've added one green chili in it. That again depends on your spice level. You can add more. We eat a little less spicy food because of our kids. And of course, I'm going to put in the dreaded peanuts. Amara is not even coming close because she's like, "Ah, oh, I'm going <laughs> to." Then she is smiling away. You know, Amara is uh, recording this, and she's really upset with me because I am making this with peanuts. But sorry, baby. Okay, so our oil is getting warmed up. It's not boiling as yet. <laughs> Amara is always correcting me when I tell her it's close to boiling. And I'm gonna now put in my masalas. This may put a little namak dalega. Again, swad anusar. Put as much or as little as you want. A little bit of haldi. I'm also putting amchur. Just a tad bit. Thoda sa khatta pan hona chahiye na chaat mein. Nahi to maza kya aayega? अब इसमें द लास्ट इंग्रेडिएंट दैट्स गोना गो इन इज माय सीक्रेट इंग्रेडिएंट व्हिच अमारा डजंट नो अबाउट टुडे शी इज गोना फाइंड आउट इज टू स्पून्स ऑफ कर्ड एक तो ये बाइंडिंग में हेल्प करेगा एंड द अदर थिंग इज आई लाइक द खट्टा टेस्ट कल का दही है तो इसमें थोड़ा सा खट्टापन है एंड वी वुड लाइक दैट इन आवर टिक्कीज I can see my sabudana khichdi is ready. I love this. This is my my soul food. I look forward to ekadashi every month so that I can have my sabudana khichdi. Can you see the translucent pearls over there? That is how we know that the sabudana is ready. Okay, I'm also going to put a little bit of hara dhaniya in here. There we go. And I'm going to give it another mix before we start making our little balls of juices. Okay, so our sabudana khichdi is ready and the only thing that I need to do is put some curry patta and hara dhaniya usko dressing ke liye dalenge. Nimbu is optional. A lot of people like to put lime on their sabudana once it's ready. I don't do it. but it's your choice show sure cat and now for these little balls i'm just going to make some sabudana balls 
while the oil is ready it is ready actually and then we're gonna drop them in there thoda sa usko flatten karenge to evenly cook hoega it has to you know deep fry so we want to cook from the inside as well and let's start with one batch and i'm gonna drop in these We're getting there. Okay, I'm gonna just turn them once over, very gently because they will break apart if we are not careful. Oh, well, I wasn't careful, so one of them has slipped. <laughs> oh, look at them! They are nice and definitely crispy. And mouth is watering, and you can see the sabudana khichdi is also ready. As you can see, our sabudana vada are ready. Our khichdi is right here, and I made some round, some the traditional flat way. You can make it whatever style you want. You can even make it like a medu vada. The option of sauces is there. Varun likes it with ketchup, and so do the kids. But you are welcome to use mint chutney. Uh, Tomato chutney, whatever works for you. Now I'm gonna try this one. It's cool enough for me to bite into it. Not like Varun, he likes it piping hot. But mm. oh, 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 oh. Mm. it is so good. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. Now see you next time. Ciao.